Yolang is here again, and today I want to introduce you to some grains performed by the choir of the Sedensky Monastery. I always ask myself the question, why do I enjoy listening to choral sound so much? It's not enough to just say, there are such Atlantic vocalists, and together it sounds so great. Now, they can have all the vocal talent in the world, but if they don't have musicality in what they are doing, it just sails flat. One of the reasons this choir is so good is because their technique is impeccable. So I'm so excited to listen, to learn, analyze and react. It's always interesting to see how the technique helps the artistry, and the artistry helps the technique. One thing that's very really nice and I look for this a lot in a good ensemble is how is the rest of the choir matching with the soloist. But this is a really tight, really together choir. But I don't want to get too technical here. The song gets under the everyone's skin, even without it. Let's hug and love each other and listen to this fantastic choir. Порою, что 
солдаты С кровавых не пришедшие полей Не в землю нашу полегли когда Превратились в белых As Michael sings the lines that did not die in our land, but so turned into white grains, then an oppressive silence sets in. You can feel the general tension in the hall. It's coming through the screen like I can just all of a scrap it. The audience hold their breath, their thoughts return to a painless, painful time. That must never be repeated again. And the only person who can prevent the repeat is sitting in the front row in the auditorium. Thank you for sharing this painful song with me and thanks again to all who commented on my posts. Bye bye. See you soon. Yolan. Bye bye. See you soon. You're